What's going on guys? I'm Jonathan Bloggs and welcome to Create Chaos Gossip. I have some very interesting things to talk to you today, but first, please ignore my massive sunburn. I did not put enough sunscreen on apparently and my poor little big fat nose got all burnt up, so please ignore that. Alright. Onto the news. So Mackenzie Ziegler is causing waves once again for allegedly going to another party. If you'll recall, I don't know, a week or so ago, Mackenzie Ziegler was called out for being at a party with a bunch of other influencers, and people were very upset with her and very mad with her because they said that she was being very irresponsible with everything that's going on in our world. I won't elaborate on it more than that. But you know what's going on, we all know what's going on, and it's better for everyone if they just stayed home, you know what I'm saying? So people were very upset at Kenzie a couple weeks ago because she went to a party with a million other influencers. And Kenzie came out and said she was sorry, she was going to stay home for the rest of quarantine. She said she would not be going to any more parties for the rest of quarantine, which everybody was really happy about. And her mom, Melissa, came out and said, you know, she's a good kid. She just went to the party for 10 minutes to pick up her friend, and she just happened to be in a picture from there. But she didn't really go to the party, she just went to pick up her friend. So people weren't really buying what Melissa said, but, you know, it's Melissa, so you know, what you're gonna get from Melissa. She's gonna protect her kid no matter what and try to make Kenzie look the best. And we respect that, any parent should do that. But I also don't think you should lie for your child. So hopefully that was the truth and Melissa was telling the truth because I also don't think you should lie to cover up for your child. So now we come to yesterday. Kenzie is back on TikTok room and all over Twitter that she's gone to another party. And this party allegedly happened at the Hype House. I will insert the picture here. This is the picture that was making the rounds all over Twitter and Instagram of her and Alex. And let me tell you, fans, casual viewers, everybody was very upset that Kenzie did this. And the TikTok room posted it on their page. And then this is when things get interesting because her mother, Melissa, I believe commented on the TikTok room post. And I will show you what she commented here, and then we will talk about it. Melissa says, Kenzie did not go to another party. She has brown hair in the picture. Stop hating on her. So I got to looking at Kenzie's Instagram and looking at the hair that she has in the picture of her and Alex. And I mean, it looks pretty close to what her hair looks like now. I'm gonna post a picture of her hair from six days ago in the Instagram post that she posted. I'll put that here. And then I'm gonna post a picture that she took back in May where her hair was a little bit different and I will post that here. So from the picture in May, you can clearly see her hair is brown with some highlights in it. And then you look at the picture from just a couple days ago, her hair is shorter, but it's still brown with some visible highlights in it. So you look at the picture of her and Alex, her hair does appear to be brown, but there are visible highlight streaks in it. So this picture could be recent, it could be from back a ways, you know, you can't see the length because she has it pulled back. and. You know, there's no real way to say whether she was at this party or not unless people that are at the party come out and say she was at the party. I found this tweet on Twitter that was very interesting that I thought I would bring out to you guys. So I'm going to read it for you. Well, I'll post it right here. Hype House allegedly had party yesterday. Few influencers have posted about it, but it appears Tana Mojo, Kenzie Ziegler, Katie Sigmund, and Nessa Barrett were allegedly at the party. Kenzie turned off tags on Instagram last night to avoid being tagged in pictures. What are your thoughts? And they posted the picture of her and Alex. So I tried to tag Kenzie in a picture today, and you are able to tag her in pictures today. You know, maybe she turned it off and turned it back on. I don't know, that's not confirmed. I don't have proof of that, just going off of that tweet. And I don't know if the Hype House had a party. They're being very low key about their parties for obvious reasons, because they've been called out nonstop for partying. So once again, how are you gonna know? But there is a smoking gun, I tell you. There is a smoking gun. It's something that Kenzie tweeted and deleted. I will post it here.
which makes her seem a little more guilty because she tweeted the morning after this alleged party, I'm sorry, and then deleted it. So that to me is a little suspicious, but I don't know. Maybe it's all made up. Maybe Melissa's telling the truth. Maybe she was not at that party. Maybe her hair is different and it's an older picture. I don't know what to tell you, but it's interesting. And I just gotta tell you guys, wear a mask, wash your hands, social distance, and things will be a whole lot better. That's all I gotta say. But what do you think about Kenzie? Did she go to this party? Do you think she did? Do you think she didn't? Do you think Melissa's lying about it? Do you think Kenzie's lying about it? Do you think Kenzie said, I'm sorry, based on the party? I don't even know. So you guys gotta tell me what you think. Leave a comment down below. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I make new videos all the time. And check out my TikTok at Create Chaos Gossip for all the latest in internet celebrity, dance moms, TikTok people, whatever you want. It's all there, I swear. I work really hard on it. So thank you guys so much. So thank you guys so much for watching this video, and I'll see you later. Bye!